hi everybody and thank you for watching so here is another cvs haul so i did go to cvs there are a lot of products here i have close to about maybe seven transactions to show you guys so like always i'll go over the breakdown of each of the deals show you my receipts and let you know how much i paid in the end i do have multiple cards so you do see a few of these deals i have duplicated um so like always i'll go over each of those and then um yeah okay so the first deal that i did so i did a whole bunch of body wash deals and so on this card what i did was um if you watch my other video i got some of the axe uh body sprays this time i decided to do the body wash because i did have a four off of 25 uh body wash crt so what i did was i picked up two of the olay first so the olay they are two for 14 buy two get four dollars back we do have a five dollar off to digital coupon that you can clip also if you go into the png website you could print off a five of a two paper coupon and usually with the paper coupon and the digital coupon they will double dip and come off so you're basically getting ten dollars off and then getting four dollars back works out to be free so that's an amazing deal there for the olay so i did do that um i also did the axe so my store they only had the axe the fine um fragrance ones so they are 7.99 buy one get one fifty percent off buy two get three dollars back we do have that amazing seven dollar and fifty cent digital coupon off two of them so that came off as well so i'll just quickly show you my receipt and work let you know how much it all worked out so basically between the two acts and the two olay it came to just over 25 dollars. i think it's like 25 50 or 25 48 so i will show it to you here so here are the two Olay at two for 14. There is the Axe at buy one, get one 50% off. I have my five of a two Olay coupon. I have my 750 off uh, two Axe coupon. My $5 Olay digital did double dip and come off. I have my four of 25. I only had $2 on this card. So I spent, I rolled two and spent 248. So altogether I spent 448. I got $7 back. I have the $4 for the Olay and then I have the $3 for the act. So in the end, it works out to be a $2.52 money maker. So really quick, easy deal. So if you do have those coupons, that's a quick and easy deal that you can do, and it's a money maker. And you've got two body wash for yourself and then two for your partner. So a really good deal there. Okay, so the next, I'm, I'm just going over my transactions. So uh, my next transaction, what I did was I did the L'Oreal. So this is a repeat deal. I just needed to finish it off on this card. So the L'Oreal, they are two for nine, a buy two and get um, $4 back. I do have a three of two printable coupon that I printed from coupons.com. It was expired, but my store still allowed me to use it. So that's $3 off. And then we do have a $1 digital that is double dipping and coming off. So that took $4 off, so I paid 5 got $4 back, worked out to be a cost of a dollar each. So that's a really good deal there for the L'Oreal. So I did do that. Um, another good deal that I did is the Dove uh, Men and Women uh, Shampoo and Conditioner. So it's two separate promotions. So they're both, uh, so the women's is buy one, get one 50% off, buy two and get $4 back. The men is the same, buy one, get one 50% off, buy two and get $4 back. So I went in there, um, I actually had a, a 5 of a 25 hair care CRT. So between the Dove there, that's only about uh, $19, which is why I threw in the L'Oreal to make it even a sweeter deal. So with the Dove, um, so the women is, I'll just show you the quick breakdown. So the women's is $5.19, the second one is $2.59, the men's is uh, $7.49, the second one is $3.74. So for all four of them, it came to 1901. I had two three dollar off two paper coupons. So I use the ones that expired, but we do have some that are coming into this week's inserts. So if you're lucky enough to get um, early inserts, you can utilize those. Or if you're part of their email mailer, maybe you've got some coupons there as well. But I did have two three off of two coupons. I actually had a $2 digital that did double dip and come off. I wasn't expecting that one. And then I had my five off of 25 CRT on hair care. 
So I just incorporated in here. So I paid six dollars and one cent. I got the two four dollars back. So it worked out to be a one ninety nine money maker. But if you factor in the L'Oreal with that one, so between the Dove and the L'Oreal using my five for twenty five CRT, all of this works out to be a ninety nine cents money maker. So really good deal there. So I paid a dollar here, but I made two dollars there. So yeah, I'm one dollar money maker overall for those. So really good deal there on that one. Okay, and so the next deal that I did, um, I did the spend 25 and get $8 back. So there's a variety of different products that you can pick up. I actually have two scenarios here. So this is the first scenario. I just did all um, feminine care. So I just did all of the Ubuy Kotex because I did have two... Um, $3 off 10 CRT. So these are products I'm going to use anyway. So I might as well pick them up and it works out to be pretty cheap. So the Ubuy Kotex is part of that spend 25 and get eight. And so they are buy one, get one 50% off. So I have a variety of products here. So I do have the regular liners as $6.79. The second one is $3.39. The teens are $7.79 and then $3.89. And then the liners is $2.09 and then $1.04. So for all of those six there, it did come to uh, $24.99. I had still some $2 off to insert coupons. These are pretty old coupons, but they don't expire until the 13th. So I still had a few left. I've been using those a lot at um, Rite Aid. But yeah, I did have two of those that took $4 off. We do have a $1 digital that did double dip and came off. And then I had two $3 off 10 CRTs on Feminine Care. So that took $6 off. So I paid $13.99. I got the $8 back. Worked out to be a cost of $5.99. But there is a $2 I bought a rebate on one um, liner or pad. I wish it was more, but I got $2 back. Worked out to be a cost of $3.99 or $0.66 cents each. So I thought that was a pretty good deal there on those. So I did do that. Okay, so that's one transaction. So I have the L'Oreal, the Dove. I have um, the U by Kotex. So over here, you have the L'Oreal, the two for nine. There are all of my U by Kotex, so all six of them there. There is the women's uh, Dove Shampoo Conditioner and then the men's. So over here, you have uh, two $3 coupons for the Dove men's and the Dove women's. Um, I also have a $3 coupon on the L'Oreal. And there's my two $2 coupons for the Ubuy Kotex. There's my $2 Dove that did double dip and come off. Same with the $1 Ubuy Kotex and the $1 L'Oreal. I have my 5 of 25 hair care and then my two $3 off 10 um, feminine care. So I did roll $23. This too um, is the double dip. Um, I've mentioned this before with couponing with Sal. She mentioned this. So this $2 was that $3 there. Um, so I did just roll $23. I got $20 back. I got $4 for the Dove Women's. I have uh, $4 for the Dove Men's. I have $4 for the L'Oreal, as well as $8 back for the Spring Spend 25 Get 8. And then I also got $2 back for my Bada. So everything worked out to be a cost of a dollar. So really good deal there on those. So I did try to utilize as much of my coupons as I can. And so that is a really good deal there. Okay, so the next deal that I did, um, I did the Johnson deal. So the Johnson, it is spend 15 and get $5 back. I actually picked up three of them because I did have a four off of 20 CRT. Okay, so that lotion over there is $5.59. Um, this shampoo is $7.29 and then the other like moisturizer is $7.29. So for the, those three there, it came to $20.17. I actually still had some $2 uh, printable coupons that I got quite a while ago from my coupon ferry. It expired on the 25th, but I was still able to use them. So I did use three of those. And then I did have a 4 for 20 CRT on Johnson. So I'll just quickly show you my breakdown here. So I do have those three. I have those. I did roll 10 Paid 17 got the $5 back here. Work out to be a cost of $5.17. So I was happy with that, um, but I did notice. So I was uh, Real Deals posted on her community tab that there's a new Activate Rewards 
uh, promotion going on. And so if you spend $20, you get $5 back. If you spend $30, you get $10 back. And it actually started on May 1st. So I am going to try to submit my receipt to the Activate Rewards because before coupons, it was um, $20 worth of items. And so if that does come through and they don't factor in coupons, that's another $5 back. This worked out to be a cost of 17 cents. So that is a bonus. I, uh, I just found out about that Activate Rewards uh, yesterday. So I will submit this and see what happens. I didn't incorporate it in my breakdown because it's something new and I don't know if I'll get it. So I just left that out. So I did do that. Okay, so the next deal that I did, um, so this is a separate card. Um, I did the Olay deal again. And then um, I on this card, I had a four for 25 uh, CRT on body or hand. I did something different. So what I did was I picked up two of the Olay for $14. These Dove uh, hand soaps, the foam ones, they are $4.99, buy two, get um, $4 back. So $4.99 for two of them, that comes to $9.98. Getting $4 back makes a $5.98. Um, couponing with Sal mentioned that if you have these uh, tear pad coupons, they're actually working for those items there, so only for the foam ones. So I did test it out on self-checkout and it did work. So I was able to utilize two of those. So taking $4 off that brings it down to $1.98 for the two of them or 99 cents each, which is pretty good. Um, so I did do that. So basically um, I picked up two of the Dove hand soaps and then two of the Olay. That brought me to about $24, um, so I was just short of uh, the $25 to use my 4 for 25 CRT. So what I did was I threw in one of these um, CVS hand soaps for $1.49, or $1.47 I think it is. So I did throw that one in as well. So I picked up one, um, hand, uh, one CVS hand soap, two of the Dove foaming hand soaps, and two of the Olay. So I will show you my receipt. So over here, you've got the Olay, two for 14. You have the CVS hand soap at 149, and then the two Dove. So over here, you can see the two $2 coupons. That's these $2 coupons here for the Dove. I have my five off of two Olay that I printed from PNG Good Every Day. My $5 off two Olay Digital, did double dip and come off. And then I have my four for 25 body wash CRT. I rolled $3. This $3 is a double dip extra bucks of that one. So that was basically free. So I rolled three, paid $1.47. So altogether, I paid $4.47. I got the $8 back. So I got uh, $4 for the Olay as well as $4 back for the Dove. Works out to be a $3.53 moneymaker. So really good to that. Even without the double dip, this will work out to be a $0.53 cent moneymaker. So really good deal there on those. Um, I ended up repeating the same deal again. So I repeated, I did two of the Olay, two of the Dove. And then I did uh, the Dove uh, women's hair care and the men's hair care. So I did all that together um, because I did have, on this card I had a five, uh, I had a four for 25 body wash. I had a $2 off any body wash. And then I had a three off of 15 Dove. Um, I was trying to make the double dip work again, um, but uh, for some reason that 3 over 15 did not come off and um, I had to spend out of pocket when I was going through self-checkout. I had um, the main cashier and she would not um, accept my paper coupon. It asked for an override. She didn't want to override it, so I ended up having to pay a little bit out of pocket, but um, it still works out in the end. I just ended up spending out of pocket, but just um, rolling into my extra bucks. Okay, so I will show you that receipt. So same breakdowns with the Olay, the Dove, and the um, CVS. And then this one uh, was a little bit of a cost because my 3 over 15 didn't come off. Okay, so over here, you've got the two Olay, you have the two Dove, this is the um, men's, or this is the, sorry, this is the women's, this is the men's. There's a CVS hand soap and the two Dove um, hand soap. So I have my $5 off to Olay. I have my two $2 Dove. 
I have my $3 Dove Hair Care and my other $3 Dove Hair Care. There is my 5 off of 2 Olay Digital that did double dip and come off. My $2 off Dove, I have my 4 for 25 and then my $2. So I rolled 7, I was hoping to double dip on the 7 to lower my out of pocket. She did not want to override it, so I had to pay $9.48 out of pocket. So altogether for everything, it was $16.48. I got $16 back. I got $4 for, um, this is for the Dove Hand Soap. I have $4 for the Olay. I have $4 for the men's. And then I have $4 for the women's. So I did notice here on um, this one. See, so it does incorporate Love Beauty Planet Body Wash, Dove Hand Soap, and the Twin Pack. So it's part of that same promotion there. When you buy two, you get $4 back. So in the end, it worked out to be a cost of $0.48. Cents. If that 3 over 15 hair, Dove hair came off, this would have been a money maker. But either way, I'm still happy with that. So I did do that. So those are all the main small deals that I did. And then on my other card, I had a 10 off of 70. Okay, so after I did those, I did one transaction at sell checkout and the double dip work. On the second transaction, um, she did not want to override it. So uh, she... I just went through with it and then she noticed I had a few more items in my cart and then she said, well, next time come to me. So she's quite a coupon police. And so I did notice when I was going around trying to pick up some more items, she actually closed self checkout so everybody could go to her. So that way I know it was because um, if she got busy, I could quickly go there and not bother her and she wouldn't be able to see my coupons but she actually closed both of the self-checkouts. So every now and then when I see her, I need to just walk out of the store because she is um, a police when it comes to couponing. Okay, so because of that, I had to adjust. I couldn't figure out how to complete this. I had a 10 off of 70 and I got a few items, but I was short. I ended up just throwing in a few extra items to get to the $70 mark. It worked out to be a cost for me overall because of that. Um, I really wish that I could have done more, but her, she doesn't want to accept. Um, she she does not want to accept expired coupons. Um, if, if the coupon doesn't scan, then it's not going to work. You can't stack paper coupons with digitals. You can't stack manufactured coupons with CRTs. She's just a police at it. So that's why I like to go to self-checkout, um, but I had to just try and make it work. Okay, so what I did was with my 10 off of 70, I did the cover girl. So with this one, uh, same breakdown. If you watch my other video, the cover girl is a buy three, get nine. If you haven't watched my video, the cover girl is buy two, get six or buy three, get nine. With these tier promotions, you do have to decide whether you're going to buy two or three. You can't just buy two and then go back and buy three and expect the extra bucks. Once you've done the deal once, it's done for the for the week. Okay, so with the cover girl, I picked up the eyeliners. They are $5.29 each. So three of them came to $15.87. I used three paper coupons, three $3 paper coupons. You can also print them from coupons.com. I got them from my insert. We also have a $3 instant coupon that's coming off. So in the end, you're paying $15.87. You're getting like $12 off in coupons. So you're going to pay $3.87. Getting the $9 back work out to be a $5.13 moneymaker. So really good deal there on the cover girl. Really good filler deal. So I did do that. Um, the next deal that I did is the Gillette and the Venus. So this is a really good deal as well. So Gillette and Venus, they are buy one, get one 50% off, buy two, get eight. I got the cheapest ones. They are $10.29 and the second one rang up at $5.14. So for the two of them, it came to $15.43. We actually have two, uh, we have $3 digital coupons, $3 off the women's and $3 off the men's. So that took $6 off. So I paid $9.43. I got the $8 back. Work out to be a cost of $1.43 or $0.71 cents each. Okay, so that's those two. So that's already $30 towards the $70. I did uh, the Suave deal again so this suave deal they are buy two or well, buy one get one fifty percent off buy two and get two dollars back so one is 329 the second one second one rang up at a dollar 64 
Two of them came to $4.93. I had a two of a two uh, coupon that I got from the Suave email list. So I paid $2.93. I got the $2 back, which got to be a cost of $0.93. Cents. So I did do that. Um, so that's already, I'm already at $35. And so what I did was I, um, I did the spend 25 and get $8 back. It worked out to be a cost because um, I was kind of, they were low on stock and then I really wasn't sure what I was wanted to do. But what I did was I just did something different. So I do not have these in my stockpile, these Degree Unlimited sprays. I want to try them out. So the Degree Unlimited sprays, they're part of the uh, spend 25 and get eight. They are buy one, get one 50% off. So one is $10.99. The second one is $5.49. I do have a $3 coupons, they did expire, but we also have a $3 digital if you want to do this deal as well. So um, that comes to $16.48, getting the $6 off, work out to be a cost of $10.48. Also, I did pick up the Cardinal. The Cardinal is part of the same promotion. It is $10.49. So the way it worked out between the degree and the Cardinal. So over here, you've got the degree in the cotton now came to $26.97. I had two $3 off two coupons um, for the degree. I had a $1 coupon for the cotton now. I paid $19.97. I got the $8 back. Work got to be a cost of $11.97 or $3.99 each. That is pretty high, but I do have that spend $70, get $10 off. So in the big scheme of things, it worked out okay so that's all i really had and then i was kind of stumped of what else i could get because i was short six dollars i could have thrown in the l'oreal but knowing um that cashier if i got her she would have she would have rejected it so i i didn't know what else to pick up so i was walking around the store and then i found these um i guess they're easter clearance so these um pimple patches i know that my stepdaughter buys these quite a lot at target so i did pick these ones up more or less for her um they were uh 75 off so they're normally 4.99 they rang up a dollar 25. So I did throw in four of those and then um, to get me just over the 70, I just picked up two of these Mentos. They were just at the checkout. They are two for 250. So I did throw that one in as well. Okay, so that's all I did for the spend uh, 70, get 10. I will show you my receipt. So over here, you got the two Mentos. You have all of the four pimple patches. You have my cotton nail, you have my degree. You have my two suave, you have my Gillette, the men's and the women's, and then the three cover girl. So over here you have three $3 coupons for the cover girl. You have two $3 coupons for the degree, $1 for the Cotonel, and then $2 for the suave. There's my two $3 digital coupons for the Gillette men's and then the women's Venus. I have my 10 of a 70 as well as my $3 cover girl. On this card, all I had was $15. That's all. Um, after this receipt, I have more, but I only had $15 left on this card. I ended up having to pay $18.70 out of pocket. So altogether, $33.70 out of pocket. I got $27 back. I have $8 for the Gillette. I have $9 back for the CoverGirl. I have $2 back for the Suave, as well as um, $8 back for the Spend 25, Get 8. So in the end, it worked out to be a cost of $6.70, which is basically the fillers that I spent on the Pimple Patches and the Mentos. Um, and so that's basically it. So a lot of deals at CVS. Um, I did do quite a lot. Um, I think I am done. I've basically maxed out most of my cards on the deals that I wanted to do. And so um, that's basically it. Okay, so for all these items on the table, everything here, the cost would have been, the sale price would have been $239.80. After all coupons and CRTs, I paid $92.30. I got back $83 in extra bucks as well as $2 back from my barter for the U by Kotex. So I paid $92.30. I got $85 back. Everything here worked out to be a cost of $7.30.
so amazing deal there so really happy with all the deals that i got at cvs um i did do a few double dipping with the extra bucks on some of the transactions um i am trying to limit those because sometimes they ask for the cashier to override it and you can only do that double dip on um the self-checkout so i am trying to limit that but every now and then if i can get a few dollar savings i'm happy and i was really happy with all these deals and that's not incorporating um the activate rewards so if i get that five dollars from activate rewards this worked out to be a cost of only two dollars and three cents so really good deals at cvs um let me know what other deals that you're doing that I did miss out on. But yeah, the Olay is an amazing deal if you could print off those coupons from the website. The Axe is amazing, all digital, um, very user-friendly deal. Uh, the Dove is really good as well if you have the coupons, three off of two coupons. Um, I am completely out of them, I think it is. Um, oh yeah, so I still have one of them. So these are the coupons that I did utilize. Um, so these are $3 off two. They did expire on the 29th, but my store still allowed me to use them. And I know that we're getting new ones um, this coming Sunday. So if you have these coupons um, and you have like a 3 for 15 Dove CRT, that's a pretty good deal there to do the women's and the men's. So you can use two of these coupons and get that deal there. And then um, with the Dove, the Dove hand soap, I think we have coupons coming soon but if you have those two dollar uh, tear pad coupons and you're comfortable using them especially at self-checkout you can get those for pretty cheap i have quite a few of those coupons um, but i really kind of want to save them for body wash because it doesn't expire until the end of the year and so it's only may so i really wanted to use them wisely and i have a lot of hand soap in my house i really need to kind of um downsize a little bit or give some away as gifts um but i think that that's about it that's everything i got at cvs and uh, yeah thank you for joining me <laughs>